Hello and welcome back to Harvest Moon Back to Nature. It is the third of summer. Last episode crushed the swimming festival. I was kind of worried but uh, it did work out and we won the super ultra rare piece of lumber. Uh, I tried to do some research on it and the only thing that would come up was about regular lumber so I'm leaving it in my cabinet but I'm honestly going to assume that it's just regular lumber for whatever purpose. I guess they got rid of their really expensive gift and didn't think they'd have to follow it up next year. Or maybe they had another power berry prepared for the new winter and then it was me again, so. Whatever, we have it. Okay, Sunny. So I'm actually thinking about trying something new this season. So because there are going to be typhoons, I'm thinking about trying out to see if putting Sassy in the greenhouse will prevent it from being destroyed. Also, good morning, guys. So, I'd heard about that in the 64. Actually, I think one of my commenters uh, mentioned it. So, uh, I'm gonna try that out and see. And, uh, I guess there's no really way to prove it. Because it could just be, you know, just happen to not destroy it. But we'll see. You know. Maybe I won't get some at all this season and I'll be extra lucky. Oh, I did forget to plant the uh, carrot seeds I bought yesterday, but that's not a big deal. And then I spent all my time watering. I'm hoping for some rain, that would be... Where are you? There you go. I swear I'm not hearing a point of winning anymore. I mean, I do have my volume kind of turned down because the music's pretty loud, but still. Good morning, my cows and my sheep. You do look happy today, Moo Moo. Giving milk to us, cowie. Yeah, I did cut some grass yesterday. I thought about letting them out, but... Letting out five animals is too much, and I feel cruel only letting like one or two out. Watch your brothers and sisters have fun! Hey there, Barley. So today is Potpourri's birthday, so I've decided I am going to give her a gift, but I'm not going to wrap it. But I will give her a spa egg because she will be in the mountain as I go to collect the red grass. So, and Anne, I might try to get a liked gift, because I don't want to push her to orange or red or whatever's next. I feel like it is orange. I think Kieran does have one more heart level, which I should get no problem. Um, I've already water. So yeah, I'll give Potpourri tomorrow is Harris's birthday. He also, of course, likes spa boiled eggs. Thank you, that's a little too close for comfort opponent. Am my fish grown at all? Woohoo, one fish. After a month of giving you uh, fish food. All right, I also need to pick up four flowers. And of course tomorrow I'll pick up eight. Good morning. I was taking a drink of water. Have to have the noisiest things. I usually have a, uh, not that it matters to you guys, but I usually have a, uh, a cup that has a straw. But my cats, especially one of them, loves to come and chew on the straw. Not only do I, I not want my straw chewed on because I don't want it messed up, but I don't want cat mouth germs on it. So if I have it in like a water bottle or something without a straw, they usually will leave it alone. Emphasis on usually. Okay, so we'll save those three. Thank you. 
Yeah, I remember the first time I uh, gotten like some fast food place for, for dinner or whatever and brought my drink back and I stepped away for whatever and came back and one of my cats was uh, flossing his teeth practically with, with the straw and I was like, okay. All right, Potpourri, happy birthday. What, a birthday present? Wow, are you sure? Thank you. At our poultry farm. <laughs> and back to n normal. Let me go get the other... You know what, maybe I'll store this red grass. I think Kano likes different colored gla uh, grasses. He might also like different colored glasses too, I don't know. I don't know his style. Or there's someone else who likes red grass. Hi, bunny. I bet the bunny likes red grass. Bun bun. You go after my basket now, bunny. I'll get Elmer Fudd after you. So I've been trying to think, you know, sometimes your mind just thinks of unimportant things for no reason. Uh, I was doing that actually last night while I was sleeping, and I was like, have I been calling my horse Flash instead of Epona? Because, you know, that would be excusable because that was my horse last time. But I don't think that's the case. I think I was calling her Shadow, which is a horse in another playthrough I've been uh, following along with for guide purposes. Yeah, let me get yeah, not that it matters, but you know, when you're, oops, I need some uh, bread too. But and again, you know, when your brain gets stuck on things, you kind of have to figure it out before you can move on. And some bread. Okay, and then some oil. <laughs> that piece of lumber. I think I got everyone's taken care of. And this will give the sprites time to uh, get some watering done. Hopefully they'll do a good job. The way I planted the flowers, that'd actually be a good use if you had the, uh, the Mistral watering can. It, it waters, I think, 12 instead of 9? But other than that, that's I don't really see the purpose unless you're planning side by side like that. He never gives me any praise. Wah wah wah. I guess Cliff doesn't have to work during the summer. He must be a teacher. It's holiday time. And we'll give. No, I don't need Basil. Zach. I know you don't really care for that, but... Oh, thank you. I have someone in mind, but she's already married. I know, I wish I knew who that was. If I could help you out. Oh, never mind, she's married. <laughs> never mind. Thank you very much. Yeah, she's def that's definitely orange. As colors. You startled me. Here, Karen. Go ahead. Since the last few times I've slammed the door in your face. In the name of love, of course. Uh, oh, perfect. I can hold four. Hey, well, let me pick it up. Flour is still used for baking like it was the last time you bought something. Tomatoes? Yeah, 84. Okay. So I need to save. 
some of everything else. Okay. And don't need anything else in here. Got it. Hello, Ellie and the doctor. Sounds like you'd be a uh, reality TV fan. Ellie and the doctor. Well, why are we here? Nothing. Yeah, yeah. Hi, Ellie. Careful, there's a flu going around. Um, Kai won't be out yet, so let me see if I can get the cliff. Oh, hey, Anne. Is there gonna be a scene since you're both in here? Huh? Oh. And man, if she made it all the way up to her room, ooh, she did. Goodness. Oh, no cliff. You're not playing that off, Anne. I saw. Hi, Doug. Hi, Doug. Alright, well, I'm definitely not gonna wait on the beach for two hours. I know we're going to the firework festival together, Kai, but, uh, even I have limits. I will pop in and see if Cliff's there. And then I will help the sprites water. Got what I was doing. No, are you down here? Maybe now's the time he's helping with in inventory or something. There he is. The storehouse is nice and cool. is in a nice location. I think that's why the people are so nice, too. Pretty sure that has nothing to do with it. People are nice because there's a winery here. Okay, now to keep track of the sprites. Maybe I'll leave Timid for last because he's probably going to be the easiest one for me to keep up with. Okay. Wow, look how much- oh, there you go. That's a plot that's almost been- Okay. I wish you guys would go in like an even pattern. Oh gosh, okay. Orange done. Oh, they're probably down here with the flowers. I was like, where are they? Alright, there's Timid. Well, Kai will be more than ready. I already got you. Here's red. Ooh, I almost missed them. Alright, where's, where's yellow? You in here taking a nap? I did hire four of them, right? You guys aren't crushing him or anything? He's still working? Did I only tell him to do a day? No? Alright, well I might have to come back for, uh, for Hoggy. I don't want to miss Kai. He's gonna be where I can easily see him. Hello, where are you, buddy? Where if they water the ones that don't need to be watered. Anyway, we got more important things to do. We got a Wu Kai. I mean, man, we had to wait a whole year to ask a girl to the goddess festival, but we basically are befriending Kai for one day and we're already going to a thing with him in three weeks. But it's good. It, it uh, moves his friendship forward, so. Like I said, it would have been nice to have it with Karen, but we can do that later. No. 
Thank you, you're the only guy who's nice to me. Oh, hi, I want something to eat. Like some water. Also sounds pretty good. Anything else? Ask. Blah, 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 blah. You just talk to you normal. No, no, I'm good. Just wanted to say hi to you. All right, now let's just let's just see if there's anything if we go back in. Just checking. Ooh. Here you go, Anna. How wonderful. I can't believe Basil doesn't just don't only talk about himself. whole reason he built the library so people could read his books. He's the committee that decides what books are allowed to go in. And this one isn't about me, so no. No go. Alright, we need to find, I think, yellow. Wow, guys, you sure have taken a lot of the hard work out of my hands. But I'm working hard. You are. You're doing a great job, little buddy. the great work guys so happy I hired you oh there we go I mean they couldn't even oh they did finish a plot good job good job guys and this one's looking pretty good too not bad at all I shouldn't complain because it's good to have help. And it beats me having to do it all myself. Oh, well. That's kind of frustrating because I still have to charge it all to do it. That was timid that got all those. I mean, seriously, yeah, he did a great job. Although, can you imagine how frustrating it would be to be the only person that's actually like fully watering properly? The other ones are just watering one square every 30 feet. Hi guys, thank you so much for the help. Good job, Timid. Good buddy. Thank you for watering what's already been done. All right, can you guys get this last one right here? No, you're going home, okay. This is, uh, this is done. But again, having them help should make it easier going forward.
right. Well, good stuff done. Good enough work. How much fodder do I have? I chopped a good bit yesterday. Yeah, 346. Yeah, yeah, yeah. But you know, when you have a full barn, think about how much it takes to feed for a season. You know, that's what, 600? I love my patterns of chopping. Maybe I'll let this section, this top section, get all in one go. I did water in here, right? Oh, I said I was gonna put Sassy in there. Oh, she is. Okay, go me. Oh, gosh. You know what I am worried about, though? Is Sassy getting stuck in the plants until they grow? Uh, all right, Sassy. Stay down there, pup. Gosh. Yes, the greenhouse might survive, but I don't want Sassy to be glitched in the, uh... I need you. Glitched in the crops. Alright, good day. Let's go greet Harris for his birthday tomorrow. It usually goes to Gots, I think, around 11. Otherwise, I guess he's in the square before that. Ooh, I'm so- I'm tempted. I'm tempted to see. My animals will be indoors. Obviously, there's no point in hiring the sprites to, uh, help. And that'll be nothing on the 5th, right? Let me check. No, nothing on the 5th. The next thing will be till the 7th, which would be a festival. Cliff's birthday's on the 6th. So. Well, that works out, because the shop would be closed. Morning, guys! So I will probably do that, you know, play that day off screen and let you guys know from there. Morning, ladies. Hello, Cowie. Barley. Dear, dear, moo moo. And little Scarlet, you so cute. Ah. Well, I guess I don't have to worry about uh, getting stuff for the sprites tomorrow. Which, hopefully for their sake they don't come out. You guys don't have to water tomorrow. I promise. And that's also part of why it's good to plant, you know, more of a crop than just what you need in the event of this thing wrecks them. Man, I'm being really upset if I lose my dog and my uh, greenhouse, but mostly the dog. Probably not. Hi, Sassy! Good puppy. Now you be careful in here. everything nice and safe. You bark away the uh, typhoon, okay? Good girl. Thank 
Yucky, my onions. Okay, so I need to save egg for Harris. Hello, everybody. Sorry about tomorrow. Ooh, I might want to save an extra egg for Cliff since the chickens probably won't give eggs. Well, no, actually, they probably will give it his, the day of his birthday, but I'll just go ahead and store one just in case. Mm, am I missing an egg? Oh, there's two there. Okay. Yeah, you can definitely save scum the the typhoons, but I kind of do want to test this out and see and if I do need to replay these days. You know, so be it. That'll be on me. So, boil these eggs. Boil these eggs. Good morning, ladies. Goodbye, ladies. Don't want Karen to get mad. I can Stardew Valley, I remember. Um, I was playing, and I forget who I was actually, like, pursuing at the time. And I think I had them kind of maxed out. And I was just talking to some of the other people because I wanted to get everyone maxed out, you know, for their friendship level. And, uh, they came up and got mad that I had been talking to other people. I heard you gave so-and-so a gift. It was like, well, I give everybody gifts. You can't be mad about that. Anyway, I just thought that was kind of a funny feature that they put in there because I was so used to Harvest Moon where, you know, you have everybody be at max affection and nobody thinks twice. Okay, get the normal stuff for the people. I will store Cliff's egg in the red grass. good and yep one for gray one ore to rule them all oh now our account's messed up good one to Sybara have them be nicer to gray man I hate that I have a typhoon already I wish if you got one you just wouldn't get any more you know so that way if you did get it early in the season it stinks but at least it's done and over with Also, it's cool being good enough friends where you can go in the shop early. Hey, don't, don't run away from my gift. Or not have Nothing I do ever makes him happy. Yeah, that, that one. But if addition to Ian from the Winter Farm, what can I do for you? Give metal ore as a gift. Oh, this is great. Thank you very much. Well, if addition to Ian, from, what can I also do for you today? Nothing. Always available. I will eventually put you to work. Oh, Cliffy. I didn't think so. Cliffy Poo! Mm. 
Are you out here, Harris? Guess not. That might have only been for that stuff with Juan. Alright, Cliff, do you have to work Saturdays? his, uh, wrist guard or whatever it is. Oh, thank you, Ian. You're a nice guy. Don't worry, I'll bring you something on your B-Day. Hi, Doug. I'll start being being better friends with you next year, probably. I can move things along further with Ellie and the doctor. Again, most people are probably waiting on me to get married. Oh, thank you, that's a big help. What are you here for? You know, oh, you know what, here. Wait, okay, 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 yep, yep, yep. Mm-hmm. I'm gonna get something for Jeff. The expensive photogizer. And because it's so pretty. Hey, Ellie. There seems to be a flu going around. Take care. You too. Back at you. Karen. Better be careful, Jeff. There's a uh, storm coming through tomorrow. I've got that drill down. Gosh. Now let me give that to him. Hold on. Oh, pretty and blue. It's electric. Oh, very kind. Thank you. Hey, I paid off all the shop's bills. I'm going to continue to work hard. That one. I'm going to keep working hard, though. Hello, Asha. Thank you, this kind of thing makes people happy. How are you doing? If you ever need anything, don't hesitate to ask. What about a discount? Oh, thank you very much. Oh, hello. You startled me. Hehe. <laughs> Harris. Well, I was gonna stop and talk to you guys, but I missed. So I think I'm going to um, put out the watering, so I'll probably pause for you guys for that, and then going after it's done, but I'm gonna try to see if I can go to the inn if there's a scene with Cliff and Anne, maybe in the evening. I haven't been to the cliff at the cliff. <laughs> the inn after hours in a bit. I mean, after hours being like, you know, seven, but... But I want Harris. Harris! Are you at your dad's house? I know Gus is closed today, but... Okay. Well, maybe I can... Oh, no, he's probably at the inn. Speaking of the inn. He's still, uh, I think, unofficially, he's keeping an eye on uh, Juan. But we'll do that. 
Sorry for the ping pong episode. See you there in a sec, Kai. If we can catch him for siesta time. <gasps> Where is everybody? Paris. Hi, Sasha. Oh, hey, everybody. Does this mean your house is locked, Mayor? <laughs> Paris. Are you again? Where are you, Harris? Who's that? I just want to give Harris his B-Day gift. There's everyone else. There's Juan. Alright guys, I'm gonna pause real quick and see if I can track down where Harris is, because I was not expecting to go on a manhunt, so just a sec. Alright, well sorry about that. It says he's at the end from two to four. So I'm early. Sorry about that. Oh there he is. Oh my goodness, of course. Wait. Thank you, it's wonderful to have my birthday celebrated by the villagers like th No, villager. Singular. Reading those letters from Aja makes me feel so much more alive. Good. Look out world, I'm ready for another day. Oh, that's cute. I like Harris in both games. He's very lively. I like how the mayor has to learn the events. Never know. Alright, well, wasn't it worth the wait giving Harris his birthday gift? <laughs> And for you, Kai? Thank you, you're the only guy who's nice to me. What will it be? You always look surprised when there's a customer. Oh! Okay guys, well yeah, I'm going to go back to my farm and I will water off screen and as I said, I will get as much watering as I can get done and then when I feel like it's enough time, I will go back to the inn and see if there's anything there. Most likely, probably not, but just in case. And if not, then I'll just end the day for you guys at the inn. So I'll see you shortly. Alright guys, so it is going on 9 o'clock. So let's see if... Anything special happens? Probably not, but in case. <gasps> yeah, look how great this was. Man! <laughs> oh, no Karen either. Hey, are you finished with work already? Oh, she's probably at the, um, at the beach. Yeah, you shouldn't be surprised anymore, Kano. Oh, okay. Well, it's going on, uh, again, close to the 40 minute mark, so I will end it here, and then next time we will see if I, uh, <laughs> If my dog in Greenhouse survive Typhoon. He's also started going to the library. Yeah. Okay. Alright guys. Well, thank you so much for watching. Like I said, I will join you guys next episode. And hopefully it won't be talking to you through tears. <laughs> Thanks for watching. Bye.